So in this short video we're going to look at the temperature change. And we'll look at things like the temperature was 5 degrees, but it's gone down to minus 3. So how much has it gone down? Well, the temperature might have been at minus 3 degrees, and then it's got warmer. It's now 4 degrees. So how much has it gone up? Or we might get a question that says the temperature's dropped 5 degrees, and it's now minus 3. What was it before? Well, this short video should help you understand how to find out these answers. So our first problem was the temperature was 5 degrees, it's now gone down to minus 3 degrees. How much was the temperature change? Now it's quite handy to use a number line to do this. Start off with your positive number and then start working down until you come to your desired number which is minus 3. Minus 1, minus 2, minus 3. Now negatives are about direction. If you think we start at naught, positives are about going up and negatives are about going down. So we were at 5, we're at 5 and we've gone down to minus 3. Now we could count one at a time, so we go 1 down, 2 down, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So the number line, um, just by counting we can see the answer is 8. Or we can do it in steps and say from 5 to 0 we've moved down 5. We then go down another 3 to minus 3, and 5 and 3 is 8. But either way, we should see that the temperature has gone down by 8 degrees. So 8 degrees colder than it was before. Well, it's gone down, it's gone down by 8 degrees. And that's the answer to the first question. Now the second question, the temperature at minus 3 degrees, and it's gone up to 4 degrees centigrade. So how much has it changed? Again, we could use a number line, or we could do it slightly differently. We could say, well, from minus 3 to 0 is a 3 degrees positive move. It's got 3 degrees warmer. And then from 0 to 4 is another 4 degrees. So altogether, the temperature has gone up by 7 degrees. So from minus 3 to 0 is 3, and then up another 4, giving you 7 degrees in total. So the temperature has gone up by 7 degrees. Our final problem, we're told the temperature drops by 5 degrees and it's now minus 3. What was it before? I think a number line will help us. So we need our minus 3. Now if it's dropped, it would have been higher. So we need to go back by 5 degrees. Go up by 5 degrees, because we know it's dropped. So what did it drop from? So I'll do my numbers, just going up in 1s. I'm going to put a few in. And now I just need to count always need to write positives, but I'll show you that there. I'll just draw the line so you can see clearly um, what we're pointing at. So, we're at minus 3. Um, well, the temperature dropped by 5, it's now minus 3. So if we go up in the other direction, we'll find out what it was before the drop. So we go up by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So we can see that we've gone um, 5 degrees higher than minus 3 is plus 2. So the answer is 2 degrees centigrade. Now we can check that by going to 2 and dropping by 5 and check, so go to 2, drop by 5 and see if we get minus 3. So at 2 go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So when we drop from 2 by 5 we end up at minus 3. So we know that our answer of 2 centigrade is correct.